redox reactions. Oxidation and reduction reactions. All chemical processes use characteristic chemical reactions called as oxidation and reduction reactions. The oxidation process involves the addition of oxygen or any other electronegative radical or the removal of hydrogen or any other electropositive radical in a chemical reaction. Reduction is a process which involves the addition of hydrogen or any other electropositive radical or the removal of oxygen or any other electronegative radical is termed reduction. Thus, reduction is reverse of oxidation. Redox reactions. Oxidation and reduction always take place simultaneously. That is, if one substance is oxidized, the other is reduced at the same time. The reactions involving simultaneous oxidation and reduction are called redox reactions. The substance which can bring about oxidation of other substances is called an oxidizing agent. The substance which can bring about reduction of other substances is called reducing agent. Oxidation number the phenomenon of oxidation-reduction processes in covalent and ionic substances is explained by oxidation number. Oxidation number is defined as the charge which an atom appears to have when all other atoms are removed from it as ions. It can have positive, zero or negative values depending upon the state of combination. Balancing redox reactions. The basic principle for balancing the chemical equations is that the number of atoms of each kind on one side of the equation must be equal to the number of atoms of the corresponding elements on the other side. That is to say, the law of conservation of mass should not be violated. There are two ways of balancing the redox equations. They are oxidation number method Iron electron method. In the first method, called the oxidation number method, the oxidation number of each compound is determined. Then the change in oxidation number of the compounds is determined. The increase or decrease in oxidation numbers per atom is calculated and equated by multiplying the formulae of the oxidizing and reducing agents. All other atoms are then balanced. The second method of balancing a chemical equation by ion-electron method is done by using half reactions. The change in oxidation number of the compounds is determined. The complete equation is then separated into two half reactions, one for the change undergone by the oxidizing agent and the other for the change undergone by the reducing agent. The individual half reactions are balanced by the oxidation number method and multiplied by suitable numbers so that on adding the two equations, the electrons are balanced.